Hello investors and welcome to the channel. Uh, if you're new to the channel, please do care to subscribe uh, for daily cryptocurrency news as well as cryptocurrency updates uh, for as well as cryptocurrency insights and evaluations for your investment. Our top story this week, uh, Bitcoin claims a 50 thousand uh, US dollars after a very turbulent week. Uh, this was reported by eToro Crypto uh, Roundup. Uh, so stick around uh, so that we can bring you more updates uh, and uh, insight on this story. Uh, we'll be right back. Yes, welcome back. Uh, as we previously said, uh, Bitcoin had, after having a very tough and a turbulent week, it had uh, it bounced back and reached the fifty thousand US dollars uh, mark back again. Uh, the market comeback uh, uh, amidst accelerating institutional adoption. Uh, since falling alongside the stock market early uh, last week. Bitcoin has bounced back uh, beyond 50,000 US dollars, bringing most of the crypto market back into the green. The comeback was uh, accompanied by a string of bullish headlines. Uh, for instance, gold, Goldman Sachs has uh, restarted its crypto, uh, crypto trading desk and is considering launching a Bitcoin EFT. Charles Schwab is said uh, to be exploring crypto trading and uh, Citibank has released a report that claims Bitcoin is at a tipping point and could uh, evolve into an international trade currency. Meanwhile, uh, Cardano and Binance have uh, pulled back more than 8% after Eurofic uh, rallies and uh, IOTA has gone up uh, 7 percent after developers uh, announced the release of a smart contract protocol so uh, institutions that are buying uh, buying up bitcoins faster than uh, it can be mined uh, according to data from a uh, from an on-chain market uh, intelligence firm glasgow this trend uh, could be responsible for surging prices uh, is hedge funds and asset managers compete to purchase an estimated of over 4 million bitcoins that are still in circulation as of late uh, before they are sent to a secure storage for a long term holding until uh, making of this video uh, according to bit uh, according to reports from bitdesk uh, coin coindesk sorry uh, the demand could be explained by widespread anticipation that the current rally would continue and data sourced uh, by the news outlets shows that international institutional traders are positioning to move uh, to 75,000 US dollars in the coming months. So we remember it, uh, there was a time that Bitcoin had uh, raised up to 50,000 US dollars and it went through a rough patch and now it's back and this seems to be by the institutional purchases whereas institutional traders are purchasing the bitcoins uh, in, in in lump sum and uh, this is uh, up to the making of this video four million bitcoins were already uh, estimated to be purchased and they are all still in circulation before they are sent to storage also, uh, in other news, uh, Ethereum uh, uh, is uh, scheduled for an upgrade. Uh, the developers have scheduled Ethereum upgrade uh, upgrade for July that could spur against uh, for second largest crypto asset. Ethereum uh, improved proposal will destroy tokens that were used to fuel transactions on the chain instead of paying them to miners. 
This is hoped to make Ethereum cheaper to use and reduce inflationary pressure for making the asset scarcer. Over the last week, Ethereum ha has risen 10% uh, as the non-fungible uh, token NFT craze has reached uh, heady heights. Our Twitter founder Jack Dorsey is now auctioning the first ever tweet that tweet in this format and King Kings of Leon are releasing their new album in tokenized form. So what are we looking uh, into ahead uh, is uh, these two giant uh, cryptocurrencies are going head to head. Uh, in the coming week, uh, we see that Bitcoin uh, pokes, uh, as we said, its targets to reach 50,000 mark and an all time high uh, will be $58,000 USD is once again in sight. Yet we could uh, see volatility triggered by macroeconomics event in the coming weeks. Joe Biden, which is the United States uh, president, uh, uh, 109 trillion stimulus package is set uh, for the final approval, which is both inspiring optimism in the markets and rising fears of inflation. Officially, the U.S. Uh, official U.S. inflation figures will be released on Wednesday and Friday, potentially highlighting the role of Bitcoin as a hedge against rising prices. So if Bitcoin reacts positively to the news and we could have, we could see soon uh, the prices uh, retest recorder uh, and reach just below 60,000 US dollars, just below 60K. Uh, so we are looking forward uh, for this coming week and see how the Bitcoin is done. Uh, so let us know what you think about this news and if you think uh, Bitcoin is gonna rise up uh, and back to its glory and uh, reach that highest and probably uh, to its uh, glory as we say that the mark of below 60,000 or beyond. Uh, please do give us a comment, leave us a comment in the comment section, uh, subscribe, uh, give us a follow. Follow us on our social media, Twitter, Amazing Finance News. Uh, until next time, bye bye.